misconceptions about glioblastoma. I think there are uh, many um, uh, that are out there. Um, most people, when they hear that diagnosis or hear that term, immediately uh, think of a, uh, a tumor where there's no hope or no possibility of any therapy. And with ongoing research, there actually has been a lot of advance made and we have better therapies uh, now uh, thanks to that research and improved outcomes uh, for patients. So Cervaxam was um, granted orphan drug status by the FDA last week for glioblastoma, and it's one of a number of promising new uh, therapies being developed for this diagnosis. Uh, as uh, many people are aware, immunotherapy is a major focus for many cancer indications uh, today and showing exciting and promising results. And that includes for brain cancer and, glio and glioblastoma. And Cervaxam is one of uh, many therapeutics being developed trying to stimulate the body's natural defense system, the immune system, to fight the cancer and showing promising but preliminary results.